Hey, welcome to Gardening Friends, and today we're going to put up a PVC hydroponic system. Here's the thing you're going to need. First, I picked up some, um, <clears throat> like some cr crunch lettuce, uh, little bundles of lettuce, organic stuff, of course. And here's a water pump hole saw that you're going to need and some two inch baskets right there um, two inch baskets and right here we have some hose for black hose for our pump that's some pH down I'm gonna need that to adjust our pH when we're done that is a elbow half inch elbow for the return water going down to the bucket there's a couple of 90 degree, two inch end cap and another end cap. And of course some glue and some rock wool. I don't know if I'll use rock wool or not. So, Okay, my pieces are cut. Um, here's a three inch piece I cut for my 90 degree. 90 degrees, they connect to the four inch pieces. And as you can see at the other end, there's two end caps. One that's closed and one that's open. The open part is gonna reduce to a half an inch and that's gonna go to my return bucket. Okay, next step is I gotta start drilling some holes for my baskets over here. So those are two inch baskets, so I'm going to drill my holes about uh, one and three quarters. So I got to figure out how many I'm going to put and what you want to do is draw a, a line with a string to make sure your holes are straight because you don't want your holes uh, crooked. I'm just starting to drill the holes and here's a trick so what you want to do is put it in reverse and just burn through you'll see how fast it is you put it forward to make the pilot hole then you put it in reverse That's it. Then all you gotta do is clean up and sand your holes and there we go, I got one drilled out. Uh, I just started on my second one. My little cups in there. That's perfect. Okay, as you see I kind of put it together. I didn't push this in, but it's gonna go in almost uh, flush here and over here I put in a cap I drill a 3 16th hole for my hose that's the um, the water pump that's the intake and there's the bucket on the floor you can see there's a, a, a pipe that goes up with an elbow to, to the other end cap except I forgot to buy a coupler you know to put over these two so basically it's going to go like that 3 16th hole there and uh, is it 7 8 for the half inch pipe I went and got the uh, the coupler for my end cap here mm -hmm. so I'm pretty much done the uh, the dry assembly now I'm going to glue it all together just finishing up uh, the gluing part here. Pretty simple. Just go around in circles with that on the inside. And don't misalign your 
shot because we only got one shot at this. There we go. And there we go. And that's it. That's all. Okay, well, there you go. It's all glued together. End caps, everything's on. Everything's working. Now I'm going to put water in the bucket and test it all out. First I'm going to sand everything and make it all look pretty. Right now I'm just testing if there's any leaks. I just put some water in here. I don't see any leaks. That's why it's good to use glue. There's no leaks as you can see. My holes are one inch and three quarters because I didn't want to go too wide because over here it would end up too far down, you see. So I'd, I'd rather just, what I did is I cut a slit on the, bot, on the side of my basket and uh, you see what I can do, I, I can just There you go, see? Uh, I'll change my water once a week with the nutrients. Check the pH. Matter of fact, that's what I'm going to do right now. The nutrients we need for this, for lettuce, is 24, 15, 36. Just punch in lettuce nutrients in Amazon and you're going to find yourself a, a two pound bag for $15 or something. And it goes such a long way. Here we go, my cup of java. In the bucket. Here we go. I'll wait uh, 15 minutes or so for the nutrients to, you know, go all around. And uh, I'll adjust my pH to about, I don't know, around six or so. I'm just measuring my pH is at 7.5. I already uh, added my nutrients as you saw before. Um, now I just put in some pH down, so 7.4, 7.2, there's only two gallons of water, so pH down, you know, I can only do like a few drops at a time. Hopefully next time around, my pH will drop down to around 5.5, 5.6. ,5 yeah, that's pretty good right there. It's time to take that lettuce and put it in our little baskets. Okay, all I'm doing here is I'm just uh, cutting my my cups, putting a little V in them like this. All right, my lettuce is ready, and I got my hydrogen, so we're gonna start right there.
plants are a little raggedy lettuce hopefully it'll take and start growing we'll see you guys on my next video